हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे टॉपिक स्टिल नॉट वेरी प्रॉफिटेबल फाइव मोनापोली कंपनीज माय नेम इज डॉक्टर भरत चंद्रा द वीडियोस आर मेंट फॉर द बेनिफिट ऑफ सोसाइटी मोनापोली कंपनी मींस दैट देयर इज ओनली वन सेलर ऑफ अ पर्टिकुलर प्रोडक्ट और सर्विस इन इंडिया इन मेनी सेक्टर्स देयर आर डोमिनेंट कंपनीज मेनी ऑफ दीज कंपनीज हैव बीन मार्केट लीडर्स फॉर मोर देन 30 टू 40 इयर्स some of the companies with high market share are as follows number 1 asian paint market share around 50% sector is decorative paints 10 year returns 22% per annum cagr so many years aishar motors more than 85% market share in 250 cc bikes and 28% per annum returns pd light more than 65% in adhesives 29% returns per annum IEX more than 90% and it is in power trading 10 year returns are not possible because a new company Maruti Suzuki market share around 45% passenger cars 20% 10 year returns and Nestle India around 90% market share in baby food products and 15% returns per annum for last 10 years usually it is assumed that monopoly companies are expected to give good returns in the stock market since they have very limited or no competition in their business however being a monopoly does not mean that stock market profits are guaranteed in fact there are many companies which have given poor returns in spite of being monopoly companies now some of the companies with high market share but weak stock market performance coal india in coal mining more than 80% market share but the 10 year returns are minus 5% bhl heavy engineering and industrial equipment and the market share is only 50% and 6% returns in the last 10 years hindustan zinc zinc mining and the market share 78% returns 8% colgate oral care products more than 50% market share only 8% 10 year returns itc cigarettes more than 74% market share and only 6% returns for the last 10 years now the observations number one it is not enough if a company is market leader or monopoly players in the sector you need to check the other fundamental parameters such as profit and loss account etc to decide whether to invest or not number two also in certain sectors the scope to grow may be limited hence having monopoly status is not very useful number three some of the companies are monopolies because of certain regulations and government policies and can lose their market share due to the change in government policies example IRCTC coal india etc number 4 generally speaking there is additional safety in market leaders and monopoly companies if they are part of a growing sector number 5 even if you invest in successful market leaders good returns are not guaranteed since any company's performance can deteriorate constant monitoring is always required for long term investing finally at the end of the video here is a question which was the tata group company which launched its ipo in 2004 there are four choices in front of you the choice number one titan company second is trend third one is tata motors and last one is tcs if you are not the member of stock market academy channel this is the time to subscribe press the bell icon send this video to all your friends video is good Press the like button. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. All the best.